In this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can add and remove applications from your Ubuntu installation. This installation is version 8.04.2 LTS. The first one I'm going to show you is how you can download a Debian based package off of the internet. As Ubuntu is based off of the Debian Edge distribution, the process is pretty much exactly the same. Let's go ahead and download the Debian package from the Skype website. Now that's saved on my desktop, I can simply double click on the Debian package which icon shows up as a little box. That will open the package installer and it will ask me to confirm all these changes. As I already have Skype installed, I don't need to install it but I can reinstall it anyway. It will then prompt me for my administration password as this requires an administration rights over your computer. The package installer will then do all the necessary tasks to make sure this program is installed correctly on my computer. And once it is, assuming it is a graphical user interface based application, it will then go into its respective menu in the applications menu. As Skype is an internet based application, it has gone straight into the internet sub menu. Another way of doing things is through the Admin Remove Applications Manager. This is a big list of all the applications in the repository of Ubuntu. However, it doesn't share all of them. For that, we're going to need the Synaptic Package Manager. First off, let's install the game. I like Open Arena, but I'm going to install Alien Arena as well for this demonstration as I already have Open Arena installed on this system. I simply should find the application I want in the list, or I can search it. I click on the box to say I want this application installed, and then I click Apply Changes. It will then confirm the packages that I want to add or remove, and I can click Apply again. It, at this stage, it will ask me for my administration password, but because I've already entered it recently, that won't happen. It's now going to install the application by downloading all the packages it needs off the internet, which can take a while depending on your connection speed. Once all the packages have been downloaded, the applications manager will then go and perform the necessary tasks to install the application I've chosen, the same way as the package manager does. Depending on your computer speed, this can take variations of times and also on the size of the package. Smaller packages tend to take less time than the larger applications such as Alien Arena. As Alien Arena is quite a large application, this could take a while. But then again, it might not. This does depend on your computer. Now that that's been installed, Alien Arena will be in my games menu as it is a game and there it is. I'm not going to run it because I'm recording a desktop session and we don't want to play games right now. Another way is to use the Synaptic Package Manager which is pretty much the very rock bottom of all package management on your system. Things that don't show up in the Admin Remove Applications Manager will show up in here including Skype. Skype was not in the app Admin Remove Applications Manager because it wasn't an app isn't in the Ubuntu repository. However, it will show up on here as an installed application as I can now demonstrate. Because it is installed on my system, it should be in here. As you can see, Skype has shown up as an installed application and I can simply remove it by unchecking that and marking it for removal. Since I want Skype, I don't want to remove it, but that's how you would do it. Once you've done that, you click apply and it will confirm the removal of the packages you have selected and then you click apply again and that will then remove the application. That is how you can add and remove applications using the graphical user interface.